Yeah, what's going on, Darrington? Long time no talk. Um, what's uh, what was it like to to get in uh, get into a game last week after having such a long layoff? And uh, and how excited are you about the week coming up? Yeah, man, it was definitely relieving. Um, you know, been looking forward to get on the field all year. Ended up not going my way, but at the same time, you know, I'm thankful to be here. Um, it actually felt really good to get out there and contribute to the team and, you know, help us get a win. Luke? Hey, Darrington, how did you use your time off and your time away as a rookie to, to study and, and get yourself acclimated to the playbook? You know, it really gave me a lot more time to, you know what I'm saying, dive in and Inside of meetings, ask more questions since I'm not going to be on the field getting the practice reps. Just, you know, ask a lot more questions, understand why I'm doing different things. And then, you know, talking to the players, telling them what I see when I'm not out there and then telling me what they saw when they were out there and kind of, you know, what I'm saying helping each other out. So I feel like it was more of a, you know, sit back, reflect and, you know, learn from everyone else at that point. But now I actually get to go out there and perform. Well, what can you bring to this offense over the stretch run? Uh, hopefully a lot of plays, um, you know, go wherever they need me, whether it's special teams, offense, and then produce and do my job. Jim? Darrington, it's not easy, I imagine, just all of a sudden turning it back on after not being out there since uh, in a couple of months. What what was that process like? And you feel like, you know, you're just going to keep getting better the more you're out there? Yeah, that's the way, you know, I'm trying to make it go, you know, get better every day, and then that will lead on to every week. Um, you know, it's just a – Day by day process. You got to come in, you got to work, you got to grind, and then you get in what you uh, put in. So as long as I'm putting everything I got to do, it'll show up every Sunday, every week. And you guys got a lot of running backs in the room. Obviously, a pretty good leader in Derek. Do you watch him? Do you ask him questions? What's it been like, kind of just being around him during your rookie season? Yeah, Derek's definitely been open arms to me with everything. You know, I ask him a question, he tells me anything really. You know. I was our whole position group. You know, we check up on each other. It's actually, you know, a tight-knit group. Um, it's beyond, I would say, football. You know, every other day you're asking how everybody's family, how their kids doing. So things like that definitely helps you when it comes to, you know, being on the field and communicating and being comfortable around each other. John Glennon. Yeah, Darrington, you, you may have touched on this earlier, um, but – did you feel, um, you know, even though you hadn't played in a long time, did you feel any better prepared uh, when you went out there last week as, as to when you did so early in the season as a rookie? No, nah, not really. Uh, you know, at any day it's football. Um, as long as you prepare, you know, throughout the week, then you shouldn't feel more prepared or less prepared. You know what I'm saying? As long as you do everything you can throughout the week, you should feel the same. Sure. And uh, I know, you know, this your your draft class has had some challenges, uh, certainly this year, you know, whether it's injuries or or otherwise. Um, you, you listen to any, you know, uh, criticism there might be. And, and does that, you know, motivate you in, in terms of what uh, people might be saying about the uh, the draft class? No, I really don't pay attention to that. I only get on social media when I'm posting something on social media half the time. So <laughs> I don't see anything. I really don't want to say I don't care for it, but I don't look forward to it because at the end of the day, they're not in the building. They're not, you know what I'm saying, here practicing and playing. So it really doesn't matter. Right. Smart move. Thank you. Luke? Sort of a big picture question, Darrington. What does it take as a unit for an offense for a, a running back screen pass to be effective? Uh, I would definitely say a lot of trust. Um, you know, everyone trusting they're going to be where they're supposed to be at the right time.